are you, John? Very good. Thank you. John Carres, uh, Chief Engineer for Aston Martin. And we're here in California for a full review of the, the new lineup. So why don't we go for a little uh, drive and we you can tell us a little bit about sure. the new models for Aston Martin. Just get myself comfortable. You know, you know the perfect situation to drive it, right? I do indeed. So um, what are we right now? Which model is this? This is the top so, of the line pretty much, so right? This is our Halo product. This is our uh, 15 Moglia Vanquish Volante. Yeah. So our convertible. Uh, 6 litre V12 Natri aspirated. 568 brake horsepower. Wow. Amazing. I like the design, the interior design. I mean, look at these colors. <laughs> it's like yeah. beautiful cars. Right? Yeah, very vivid, very yeah. individual. So uh, let's go for a little spin and. Um, and we tell a little bit more about so top of the line uh, is this new for 2015 2015 so vanquish uh, was launched uh, in 14 model year yeah um, and we've done a major technical update on the car already like a year after a huh? year after yeah so we've um, improved its performance so we've got a, a modified engine so we have more power for uh, 568 brake horsepower only up small we have more torque 10 newton meters more torque however we have the new 8-speed ZF gearbox in this car, rear-mounted, first application worldwide um, with our partner ZF, technical partner ZF. Mm -hmm. um, performance, 200 miles an hour plus, huge increase from 183 at 14 model year, 0 to 60, 3.6 seconds, a full half a second quicker. Wow. So uh, half a second doesn't seem like a second. lot, but it's a lot, really, it's, when you're talking about it. It is a lot, indeed. Yeah. So, uh, and this car, uh, what's the structure made of, and what are like, most of the materials that you make this car with? So, Vanquish is a uh, bonded, I mean, the base of the car is a bonded aluminium uh, structure. Um, it um, consists of castings, extrusions in aluminium. Um, we clad that in a, in a suit of carbon fiber. So some of the understructure, the rear yeah. end of the car particularly, is lightweight carbon fiber. Carbon fiber offers lightweight, it's, uh, it's, it gives the designers, the, 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 the uh, stylists, much more freedom in terms of what we can form with the surfaces of the car. So you can see uh, on the outside of the car, we've got some very crisp curbs, we've got some uh, some fantastic detail yeah. that we wouldn't necessarily be able to do in aluminium, which is great and it's stiff. It's yeah, I know. Fantastic. Yeah, we've been driven uh, the whole day here and like the car performs amazingly. I mean, this transmission is like so smooth. I mean, even when you're like going really, really fast and you try to, to downshift, like it's better than any human being, right? <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. And we've, we've paid a lot of attention to that in terms of the, the engine has a new uh, engine. Uh, transmission uh, engine uh, management system yeah. which is with Bosch um, which gives us much finer control um, of the way the fuel goes into the car the way that the, it works with the transmission controller as well so these are all fine great details that we can add to the car to, uh, to make it respond well yeah. uh, so this is the convertible there's also the conversion of this any there differences is. in terms of weight or performance uh, performance the coupe is uh, a slightly higher Vmax by a, uh, a few mile an hour. Uh, there's no difference in 0 to 60, uh, no difference in power or delivery. Coupe is a little bit stiffer uh, in terms of its uh, uh, body structure yeah. uh, because it has a it has a roof. That, that's it really. But with the, with the convertible, you, you get this fantastic feeling. Yeah. Uh, and so uh, we're going. We start at the top of the line. What's under that, and how do, do we got the other models under this? Uh... Yeah. So uh, if we start from our entry level, so our entry level is our V8 Vantage GT car. Uh, so this is a normally aspirated V8. It's our it's our smallest footprint car. Um, it's very compact. Uh, it's the sports car of the range. This is a naturally aspirated V8. Um, 430 brake horsepower in this. Um, it has a six-speed manual transmission, which is fantastic. Which I mean, is, like, that's I'm great glad you have it. it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So I've just done the drive route myself, yeah. and it's fa absolutely fantastic. Yeah, you and draw some attention with that. <coughs> I saw you at the, start, at the at the coffee stop there, and yeah, yeah, yeah. a lot of people were looking at your car. That's yeah, great. Yeah, it's great. So they, they, again, two-seater, 
that's uh, also in uh, in coupe and uh, convertible roadster format as well. So that that car, um, the Manta GT, it starts like around a hundred thousand, right? And but I mean, when you talk at that level of ninety-nine thousand dollars, ninety-nine thousand. Yeah. So I mean, that's a lot of car, and that segment is kind of crowded right now. But like this, that's part of it. Not that many. There are other cars like Porsches and like Mercedes. They're around that price. So you, you, you said earlier, earlier about the interior on this car. It's, yeah, I mean, it's spicy all red, it's, everywhere. It's yeah. absolutely fantastic. And so the cars need to be bespoke, and and the customers of those cars need to know this is the car for me. Yeah. And it's my car, and they've made choices. So when they order the car, they how long will it take for someone who like specifically wants some color or something? So if uh, a customer wants a specific colour that we don't have in our range and we have a huge range of colours that we've done uh, in the past as well, uh, we do a colour match service. So any colour you would like, we can match to. That takes longer. Yeah. Uh, it's a very bespoke surface, uh, service that we do. Um, that, that, can, that can take a few months. Okay, so Vantage, but then in that that model you have an extra now we have an extra, extra, car extra bit of spice uh, with this car so we offer the uh, naturally aspirated 6 litre V12 engine um, that we've got in this car um, again with Bosch engine management system and this time it's got 565 brake horsepower so a huge jump from the 420 that's in the um, that's in the uh, Vantage GT. So since it's uh, the same uh, size of car with it's, more power, it's, it's like exactly. the fastest Aston Martin in production right now? Uh, it's our fastest convertible that we do, 201 yeah. miles an hour. Um, it has a seven speed uh, race derived uh, automated manual gearbox, yeah. which again is absolutely fantastic and really su suits the car. Um, this car is amazing. You know, it's, it's, a, it's again compact, but it has this great engine, this great yeah. soundtrack, uh, and dynamics to match as well. It's so, fantastic. Vantage, Vanquish, uh, where are we missing? It's a Rapid S. <laughs> so, this is our four door sports yeah. car. Which is, to me, in the four door sports car segment, is the most beautiful because it doesn't really look like a four door. It's almost hard to find the, the, the back doors in the, when you see it from the distance. Yeah, yeah. Like, like I said this morning, is uh, I, I have people who, who have seen this car and gone, Wow, it's got four doors. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. Oh, there's seats. And, uh, and I think it adds uh, an element of extended, broader appeal in terms of usability. This car. So the repeat came out like in 2006, 2007? No, 2009, Nine? 2010, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, but this is almost like a new generation? It's like a, a lot of it new is. things in so, it? So we did an external uh, update on the car uh, last year. Uh, we gave the car a new face, a, a more distinct face as well uh, from the from the other products. Um, this year, again, linked with 15 Model Year, 15 Model Year Rapid S, which is about the engine. It has an upgraded engine to 552 brake horsepower. Again, it's got that that fantastic eight-speed seamless transmission that you can make yeah. for the experience. That sound is fantastic, and the sound in the room is again all Aston Martin sound, fantastic. that we're missing in this uh, event here in California is the DB9. The, the timeless beauty of DB9. Yeah. Absolutely. And that Absolutely. car, that car is coming up for a new uh, new generation pretty soon, right? Future? Yeah, who knows? Yeah. Excellent. Well, John, thank you very much. Uh, so since this is a uh, convertible, uh, can we open the roof even when we're moving? Uh, if we are doing less than 30 miles oh, an We can yeah. stop here and, uh, and, and then turn around and like, Go back topless. <laughs> we can go back topless. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, thank you very much for the time. Are we gonna enjoy the sun in California? I'm sure you're gonna appreciate that because uh, in England, I don't think you have this much uh, beautiful weather over there, huh? No. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get this top down for you. Wow. So again, we can we can go top. We can go topless uh, on the move. It's fantastic. We were driving with uh, the 
top on uh, and it's almost like so quiet you don't really even know it's like a soft top right it's fantastic yeah so we can all, always uh, we can also drop all the windows down as well so you get that full full fantastic feel great beautiful wedding color so let's go back thank you very much for the time and uh we're gonna keep enjoying no the Aston Martin lineup here in California with John, uh, Chief Engineer for Aston Martin. Pleasure. Thank you. Thank you.